Good morning, my students, and welcome to your English class. Today, my children, we are going to continue with the numbers. First of all, we are going to have the review of the numbers from number one to number seven, and then we are going to continue with the number eight, which is the new number. Don't forget that, okay? So let's start. Now, don't forget also very important that all of the numbers have a different form or shape format, okay? Now, let's start with the first number that is number one and looks like a soldier. Number two is like a dog, quack, quack. Number three is like a snake. Number four is a chair upside down. Number five is a number that likes to eat a lot, okay? So that's why it has a big stomach like the teacher. Number six is a cherry, and don't forget a cherry, it's a small fruit, color red. Number seven is a lazy number, it's always sleepy, that's why it's inclined, okay, because it's sleepy, that's the number seven. Then number eight, which is the new number, remember that looks like Olaf from the movie Frozen. Okay? And Olaf is, of course, a snowman, un hombre de nieve, okay? And snowman have two circles, one up and one down, okay? So that number eight appears here in color red. Today, my children, we are going to see two objects that appear in the night. Whenever you are sleeping, you are in your bed, with your pillow in your house and you are uh, sleeping, okay, it is called night, se llama noche, and in the night, in the sky, we have stars and we have moons, so the object of today, moon and stars, okay, now for this, here I have several moons, remember that we have to count them to see what's the result and what's the number that appears here. The same thing goes to the stars, so let's start. Here we have the moons. Please help me count to see how many are there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. They are eight moons. So the number that appears on top of them is number eight, okay? Very good. Now the color of the moons have two colors. Sometimes they can be colored white or if you paint them, you can use color blue or yellow. In the case of the teacher, I use color blue, okay? But if you want to paint it with color yellow or different colors, there is no problem, okay? You can do that. Now, let's continue with the second object. For the second object, remember we have the stars, and the stars appear in the night. When you are sleeping, they appear in the sky, okay? Now, let's count the stars to see what's the number that appears on top of it, okay? Let's commence. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven and eight, they are eight stars. So the number that appears on top of them, number eight. And the stars are color yellow, okay? But if you are painting them if, and if you want to use different colors, you can use it, there is no problem. Also, very important, these two activities, my children, appear in your daily books, okay? They are right here, these two pages. Number eight for the moons, number eight for the stars, and under the objects, we have the important part of the activity, which is to trace all number eight, okay? So it's very important that this, you remember it, and you work correctly, okay? So that's it for today, my children. I hope you have an excellent day. Don't forget to review and remember and practice always the numbers from one to number eight and also the objects, okay? Today, today's objects are moon and star. Before we go, please repeat after me. Moon. 
with M. Star with S. Okay? Very good. So, goodbye, my children. Take care. Don't forget that the teacher loves you very much. We'll see you tomorrow with a new video. Take care.